in Group E, a win for Liverpool puts them top two on at home against Genk. Meanwhile, Napoli just can't buy a win at the moment. They finish 1-1 against Salzburg. The Italians, though, will be fine to get through. However, they've got a lot of bigger issues to address over the coming weeks. Uh, meanwhile, for Liverpool, 2-1, Stevie. Got, got the job done, I suppose. It's, it's like, what do you say? Ugh. Oh, another game to play. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, yes. Another game to play. <laughs> fixtures, fixtures, fixtures. Yeah. Well, they got, to, they, they got <laughs> to give a couple of players a rest. Uh, and they did win the game. And so, at the end of the day, that's the only two things that really mattered in this. Yeah. For Liverpool, was winning a game and giving a couple of players a break. Uh, meanwhile, from a coach's point of view, what do you make of what's going on at Napoli at the moment? Diolentis, of course, said the players weren't allowed to leave the hotel after the, the loss at, or the draw of the weekend and then what happened today. Uh, Ancelotti's come out and said he's not happy with that. that he didn't, it wasn't up to him, it's up to the what's club. What's he got to do with the president? Well, Ancelotti's, in Ancelotti's in charge of the players. He says when they go to the hotel, he says when they stay, when they leave, whatever. It's got nothing to do with this guy. So I'm afraid this is up to Angelotti to put his foot down and make a stand. Otherwise, it just well, it just becomes a circus. Would it help at all? I don't quite get the the theory. If you're having a bad run and then you're in a hotel make, with all your players, I can't make a rude sign on TV. <laughs> but has it stopped you in the past? <laughs> with my hands, I can't make a rude sign. <laughs> let me tell you, that's what it would have been to whoever it was. It said, yeah. I mean, it's, I'm being, I'm going over the top here, but it's like. It's almost like kidnapping somebody, isn't it? So you can't, you can't do this, you can't do that. You've yeah. got to, I'm kind of surprised. You've got to stay in the hotel. Yeah. Grown yeah. men. I'm kind of surprised at Angelotti, you know. I mean, uh, and Angelotti, you would have thought. Yeah. He was experienced. Asked that, he said that Angelotti would have. Yeah. <laughs> <Like> Angel. <laughs> but he, I mean, you know, it's like, like, like Klopp when they were asked when they were well, asking Klopp God. if the club had played him talking to the team at half time. He said, I would, have, I would have walked away and resigned. Yeah. I mean, I, I was expecting, or would expect Angelotti. Angelotti to come out. Has he got a genius? Angelotti. To come out and do the same sort of thing. This segment's, oh, right. this segment's going well. Can you? Is there any worth from a player's point of view for this to happen? Well, it didn't happen today, did it? One one. Is no, but, but I mean, but if you're a player, of course you're going to speak out, and of course you're going to say something, but you're going to follow the instructions of the man, the, man, the man in charge. And in this case, is Angelotti. <laughs> who would tell you to stay or to go? Yeah. So it is up to Ancelotti to stand up to the team, to the team president and say, no, no, no what, are, what are we doing? L let me run my team, you do all the other stuff. But I'm guessing that if you've allowed De Laurentiis to get involved in the past in administrative things that have to do with the players, then it's difficult to close the door down. It's, 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 it's just difficult for you to now say, no, no, no. You can get involved with this, but you can't get involved with that. Right. Once you open the door, it's impossible I'm, to close I'm, not, I'm surprised Ancelotti never got involved, but I'm really not surprised that Ancelotti yeah. never got involved. Because <laughs> yeah. he's, he's weak. Hey, Ange <laughs> that guy's a winner, Ancelotti. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.